Well, hey, McFly subscribers. So I wanted to give you guys a quick update and also ask you a couple questions. First off, we are in the middle of moving. Excuse my messy desk behind me. I am packing up all my fly tying stuff. It's been <laughs> tough, but at the end of this week, we actually move and I'll be able to set up in the new place. It'll be a three bedroom instead of a two. So instead of being in my bedroom with all this stuff, I'll actually have my own room for a little while until, of course, the two kids want to sleep in separate bedrooms. They're young right now. They want to stay in the same bedroom. But anyway, I digress. The real question that I have for you guys is, I am thinking of writing a book. This is going to be more of a tutorial book on tying flies. So obviously I have my videos that I make to teach you guys how to tie flies. A lot of people wanted something where, you know, there's some info on the, on the video that they can pause and they can get all the material lists and everything. And I thought, you know, I could take all my past videos and I can actually make a book about how to tie these flies. And that way you've got a list of all the materials you need. Um, you've got some description. Maybe I can write a little bit more description than I usually do on my videos. Um, talk a little bit more, maybe a little more in depth. Um, on the specific fly and the use, the philosophy of use basically. And then I can also list out a step-by-step. -step. So that way you can watch the videos, you know, learn kind of visually how to tie the fly, and then you can go and reference the book on how to actually tie that specific fly. So that way you can take the book, you can put it up, you can prop it up on your table or whatever that you're gonna be tying on, and then you can kind of reference it from there instead of having to go back to your computer or pause a video while you're in the middle of tying. Um, kind of gives you a little, little easier way of doing it. And in the past, no one had videos. We didn't have those. Um, it was all books. You learned how to tie from books. And I think videos are a great way to learn because then you can see what that person is doing um, instead of just kind of imagine it in your head of what they're explaining on, on the book, in the book. Um, you can see it in the video, but I think um, having both is a, is a really good option. So let me know if you guys are interested in buying that book. Um, it will cost me some money to be able to basically get these printed, um, like thousands of dollars, <laughs> depending on how many I need to print. And that's the question. I want to find out from you guys, get a good understanding how many people want to buy this book. And if I, you know, if I print a hundred of them, or I print a thousand, the price per book obviously goes down, right? Um, for more that you print. Uh, but then again, if I print a thousand of them and I only sell a hundred, then I am, I lose a lot of money. So <clears throat> if you guys are interested, let me know, please in the comment section. Uh, I will try to keep the book cost as low as possible, but the more of you that want to buy it, obviously the lower my cost will be and the lower I will be able to actually sell the book as well. I don't need to make a lot of money per book, but I don't want to lose money on the book, obviously. If you guys are interested, you let me know. Put it in the comment section if you want to buy the book. It's going to take me a little bit of time to be able to put it together, probably a couple months and maybe longer. I'm not 100% sure, but... Anyway, I will talk. I'm getting a call right now. Anyway, you guys have a great day. I will see you on the next video. Now you go catch some fish. Hello.